Hey friends, Gator Mom here. I hope you're doing awesome. Today we are hanging out in my kitchen and I have a quick meal plan and grocery haul to share with you today for my family of five. All right, so I thought I would go ahead and start with my really quick meal plan. I use different things for a meal plan. You guys have seen my um, kind of meal plan journal a couple times in my grocery haul. I found this cute little pad at TJ Maxx one day and I've been using this this is just a kind of cook this on the left side and buy this on the right side. I don't really do a big grocery list every single time I go to the store. This haul is actually quite large. Um, I haven't been to the store for a big grocery haul in like two or three weeks, so this one's really big. But um, this stuff on the right is just kind of things that I don't normally get that I didn't want to forget. And then the items here on the left are just my meals for the week, so um, I just wanted to show you what I was making really. Um, on Monday, we are going to have turkey smoked sausage and cheesy rice and a vegetable. On Tuesday, I'm making baked ziti, which I make like once a week. It's like a staple in our house. Then Wednesday, we're gonna do grilled cheese and tomato soup. Thursday, um, crock pot, chicken fajitas, and a like Mexican rice. And then Friday, we're gonna do a quick Chick-fil-A for the kids, and then my hubby and I have date night because the kids go to church on Friday nights typically. And then Saturday and Sunday, I don't really meal plan because sometimes we go to grandma's, we do Disney, things like that. So we typically don't meal plan Saturday or Sunday. So that's kind of just a really brief what we're gonna be doing for the week. If you guys want to see any of these recipes that I'm doing for um, quick like meals throughout the week, let me know in the comments below, especially some of these that you see kind of over and over again in my meal plan. I am not a big baker. I am not a big cooker. <laughs> I don't really have um, a lot to share in this category, but if I can do it, you guys can do it. So if there's any of these recipes that you guys wanna see, um, let me know in the comments below because I am definitely willing to share them. Because like I said, if I can do it, you guys can do it because um, there's nothing that I do that's spectacular, that's for sure. So let's start with the haul. Over here on the right-hand side, I'm just gonna go down my counter here. Um, we did pick up some Gatorade. They were um, on sale for a dollar, so I got just five different kinds here. Then I got some waffle for the kids. Um, my kids love the Spider-Man waffles. These are mixed Berries, so they have like strawberries and blueberries in here and then I do get just some plain um, Mickey Mouse waffles for my youngest because he doesn't like the berries so I always um, tend to get both of these and then these are gone in like a day so I probably should start getting like two boxes of these but got some waffles I always tend to get BOGO pasta there's always a brand um, that's on sale this um, week this particular brand was on sale and I love these small little pot size spaghetti I've never seen these um, I'm excited for this because I'm always breaking up the pasta and putting it inside um, you know the pots when I'm cooking it so I was excited for this um, these are just like pot size spaghetti so I did BOGO on this I needed um, the ziti for big ziti that I'm doing one night so I definitely got that and then I just got some more large elbow for like mac and cheese or just regular like garlic butter noodles or whatever we're doing so I got that but I was really excited about these like spaghetti size um, so got that um, got BOGO big chewies um, these like you guys see granola bars in like all my packing videos and all videos and all that so got some more of those um, Cheez-Its were BOGO the family size so I got two boxes of those tons of bogos today like you like really lucked out on those um got some fruit snacks here i got a big 22 pack of those back here in the back i got two things of lysol wipes those were bogo also so stocked up on those oh i just heard thunder and i hope it doesn't start raining um but i also got some cinnamon rolls we like to do those on saturday morning so i got some of those um his and her creamer my husband just likes regular half and half i like the fancy creamer i wanted to try this um kind of caramel creamer this time i hope it's good i normally just do french vanilla but i got a caramel creamer got some different um cream cheese this time this is like a strawberry blend cream cheese and then i also just got like some plain so for the kiddos for bagels i also picked up some mini snacks for raisins i got like smaller boxes this time so i thought it would be easier to pack for like the parks and stuff for like my little snack bags so i got those um graham crackers for bogo so i got two boxes of those and then back here in the back some stuff for recipes um i got a taco kit for 
um, chicken fajitas out of the crock pot. I like to use the soft shells, which are down there at the bottom of my counter. Um, my kids, some of them like the hard shells, so I always get both. And then I usually just do Uncle Ben's rice um, if I'm, you know, being quick and easy. And then, so I got that, and then I got some chicken for the crock pot for that recipe, and then I got some hamburger for the baked ziti. Um, got some milk, got some lemonade back there for the kids, got some OJ, and then I got some cheese for fajita night. And then, oh, I forgot cheese for the baked ziti. Oh, sugar. I'm gonna have to go back and get um, mozzarella cheese for the baked ziti, I forgot that. Um, I got lunch meat for the week. We just got some oven gold turkey breast, and then I got some um, regular, um, I think I actually normally get white American, but Monterey Jack was on sale, so I got Monterey Jack this week. I hope the kids like it, so wanted to try something new. Um, just got some canned tuna, and then I got some, okay, back to the fact that I'm not a baker. Let's talk about that. <laughs> when I was in Maine visiting my sister, um, she makes um, homemade granola every single week and it tastes amazing so she gave me the recipe and I'm gonna try to make it and if it's amazing I'm gonna share it with you guys if I totally royally screw it up I'm gonna tell you guys that it was really good and that I don't have time to share it with you guys and that's gonna be a big fat lie <laughs> but if you want to see it let me know um, but that's only if I don't screw it up because if I screw it up of course I'm not gonna share it with you but I got all the stuff to make um, the homemade granola I got oats back there and then I got some coconut oil and then I got some um, chocolate to put into the granola because I have no self-control she didn't put chocolate in hers of course but um, got like some chopped pecans and almonds and walnuts and got some almond and vanilla extract and then um, some craisins and coconut and some brown sugar. It was so good you guys. I mean, I can't mess it up, right? I mean, how hard can it be? So got stuff to make that. I got some Easy Mac for the kids, like quick night meal. I got some more of these P3 um, little snack things, the beef jerky and the peanuts. And then um, got some coffee back there. That's just vanilla coffee for me for the Keurig. Got these mini blocks of Velveeta cheese. These are like already pre-cut so you don't have to use like you know the whole block if you just need to melt some or whatever you're using it for. Got some ginger ale because I love me some ginger ale. I drink that like all the time. Um, I needed some garlic bread for the ZD. It was BOGO so I just got two things of it. I'll freeze one and obviously use one for this week whenever I make it. Um, bananas and apples. I got some strawberry cookies. Again, going back to the no self-control. <laughs> those are for me. I'm going to hide those, you know, in the closet for when the kids go to sleep and I eat them. Um, Gluten-free pretzel sticks. These are like our family favorites. We love those. They're so good. Um, Public cereal was BOGO, so I got some Raisin Bran and like the Fruit Loops um, for the kids. Got some of these pita chips. Um, those are super yummy. I like those like in hummus or salsa or whatever. Um, got some blackberries. Um, bagels were BOGO, so I got those. And then some soft shells for the fajitas. Got a loaf of bread. I got um, sour cream and some um, yogurt for the kids. And then I got an onion, some cut up peppers down there, some whole peppers for the crock pot recipe, some cucumber, some um, tomatoes, and then some green beans um, to also eat this week. So that is pretty much everything, minus the case of water that I also picked up that I got. And I think we just beat the rain. You guys can probably hear it. I have a skylight in my kitchen. So you guys can probably hear it beating down on it now. So we just beat the rain, but that's everything that I got in this grocery haul. Again, if there's any of those recipes like the ziti or the crock pot or any of that that you guys um, wanna see, let me know. I might be happy to share those. They're super easy. You guys can probably easily Pinterest them and um, get a good idea. But if anybody's looking for super simple, easy, like quick night type things, like I said, if I can do it, you can do it. Um, let me know in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed this haul and I will see you guys next time. Have a great week.